Hello, my wonderful collectives. Welcome to my channel. This is Slavic. Good to see you, everybody. And welcome the guests of my channel as well. If you're new, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. All right, my wonderful collectives. Let's do another reading for you today. Whatever messages I have for you, I shall deliver to you. So, 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 my wonderful collectives, what messages do you need to hear? What messages do you need to hear? Let me pick the deck. What messages do you need to hear, my wonderful collectives? Show me. For you. Thieves, thieves, liars, manipulators, some sort of lovey-dovey, some sort of couple, corrupt, manipulative couple, so that they could profit from you, okay? Potentially, this individual started something new by the child, okay? It was new for them. So, these individuals are coming through, so beware that there is these enemies around your surrounding. What about this? They thieves. They're part of some sort of corrupt community. They involve community potentially. Slandered your name. From distance. They're not in the same city. They're not in the same town from you. They're actually in a bad health. Their positions are very weak. So it kind of feel since everything are coming to an end. Um, they're trying everything they could. To kind of, you know, throw this, this major uh, kick so what kind of feel um in bad house here corruption there was a corruption financially whoever these crooks are whoever this community of crooks they're not doing very good bad house they're losing their jobs some sort of female official female is in a bad house she could actually physically have a bad house i would not be surprised she is a co corrupt official. I guarantee you that at the time she uh, did this to you, she had cherry burgundy hair. The same kind of color like my uh, beautiful dragon. Cherry burgundy hair. She is a corrupt crook and she's not in a good health. She could be having actual physical issues. But taking into consideration here at work, she partnered up with another person. She's a corrupt official. Corrupt official. Corrupt official. What did this corrupt official wanted it on the first place? Why did this corrupt official did this to you? What was it in for her? And and whoever else she partnered up. Big money. Big money. It was a big money. Ace of Pentacles, I'm not talking about little money. I'm talking about big money. This individual, like I said, could be connected to policing, government, lawyer, attorney general, okay? She had shoulder length hair. She might have cut it. She might have changed the hair color. She might have redyed it natural, more natural looking like this one. So she's responsible to this. She's a corrupt official. round face she wanted big money what else she wanted yeah she's a corrupt official it's, it's, it's a justice of the peace or working for judicial system this female represents maybe crown's office crown's prosecution office attorney general in your town, but not in your town. She's on a distance. There is distance where she is and where you are. Because we have distance horizons. Maybe three and a half hours away from you. We have three, six. Between three to six hours away from you. So she, she like I said, corrupt. Corrupt. She's after you right now. She's after you, but the funny thing is that she... <laughs> Taking into consideration that her positions are doing pretty badly, 
I mean, she, she lost her status. She lost her credibility. She lost her respect in, in, in the judicial, in the judicature status. She is uh, not looking very good. But yet she still continues on. She's trying not to admit to what the heck she did. There is a masculine here as well. Who is this masculine? Who is this masculine here? She didn't do it herself, okay? Somebody else here helped her. This individual might have facial hair. Bigger build. Brunette. Okay, so now these thieves are going nuts because losing jobs. Not looking too good. She's too concerned about her job. But cannot mentally carry it out. Again, she comes up. King, uh, Queen of Swords. Also have Queen of Wands. She could be a fire sign. Fire sign. But connected, like I said, to law. Her actual astrological sign would be fire. So Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, most likely. Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. And again, we have Ace of Pentacles here. Money. It was all about big money. Big. I don't, I, I don't know what money you can actually expect to make or steal from victims and innocent people. Uh, clearly not mentally fit uh, person. Not at all. Not at all. Not at all. Who is this masculine here with her? Strengths card. Supporter, manipulator. They work together as a team. There's offer. Okay. We have empress here. We have four of pentacles. King of pentacles. And I also have a lover's card. Also means partnership. This person partner up with her. Partner up with her to have this deal. So we have lover's card and three of pentacles. This is about a partnership on a financial level. And as a result, like I said, these two thieves, which once again, just a little fracture, an iceberg of the whole entire community that here involved. But they're co-workers, okay? They have business, they have partnership together. It was partnership for the purposes of making money. You help me, I help you. Now, generally, the masculine could be an earth sign. He doesn't have to be. Um, he most likely a water sign. But very materialistic, okay? So she's a fire sign, he's a water sign. Uh, very materialistic, all about money. Self-centered, okay? Self-centered, egoistical. He could be either uh, a Scorpio. He could be most uh, Scorpio, Cancer. Scorpio, Cancer, and Pisces. Is there Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces? I will take a look. For sure, I feel like the female um, could be... A fire sign. I will take a look exactly what astrological sign of this uh, water sign. And I'll take a look also on female. Because I know that one is fire sign and one is earth sign. One is water sign, sorry. So let's take a look exactly. I got my astrological cards. Fire, water. Let's do the masculine first. Astrological sign for this masculine. What is this crook's astrological sign? We know his water, but what exactly his astrological sign? Scorpio. He's a Scorpio, most likely. 23rd of October, his birthday, to 21st of November. Secretive, resentful, very controlling. Highly controlling, resentful, have this bitterness in regards to female. What astrological sign of this female? What is her astrological sign of this female? Aries. She's an Aries. 
Uh, her birthday falls between 21st of March and 20th of April. She's very short-tempered, intensive, stubborn. Uh, so they, they, they're both crooks, okay? The, this is once again what has came up. If they're not Scorpio or Aries, uh, which I'm pretty sure they are, uh, then they have a very strong elements of fire and water in their chart. So once again, together, they here come up with this great journey, the greatest journey to cause you harm. Okay. Now, uh, let's take a look. Let's go around. Like I said, this is just a general reading. We'll see more or less when did that deal was executed, what date, and in what potentially month did these two come up with this corrupt idea to steal, to make money on you because they stole from you, right? They used you as a stool that would initially guarantee them profit, guaranteed them stability, financial stability position. And to be frank with you, they were um, they were quite happy with, with what they achieved. They were very happy with what they achieved. You understand? So. So let's take a look here. What day did these two come up with a deal? I have five. <clears throat> two confirmation of number five. Fifth. Fifth month, potentially. May. May. In May. Whatever year, I, I cannot tell for sure. But uh, fifth day or, or month, fifth month would be May. Maybe May 5th. Okay. So I'm going to leave these two fives here. Five, five. Okay. So, like I said, this corrupt deal that they have come up with is supposed to be very promising, right? Very, very promising. Now, uh, I have one question. Why would this these corrupt officials and this materialistic masculine here, why? What for? What for? Why? What's, what's the problem? Why? A legal matter, right? Disputes. It was all because of legal matter disputes and toxicity that surrounded it. They didn't want it potentially a bad reputation for themselves. So, you know, it is easier to throw an innocent victim under the bus than chase a bunch of not cases who should have, should have been detained initially. It's easy way out. It was a legal dispute. These two, like I said, conspired. They had to come up with something. Maybe they felt pressure. But there was a legal dispute. What is this legal dispute is about? What kind of legal dispute, my collectives, I'm asking you, are you involved in? Going against a bunch of not cases? Stalkers? Abusers? What is this legal matter? Chain you down. Wanted to chain you down. Interview. Hack your social media account, potentially. Or some, some sort of tips that they, were, they received through social media accounts or about your social media accounts. Reports on your, on your social media account. Something about social media account. Someone here and trap you. They're right now potentially tune in through your internet watching. Someone came in here and interviewed. Somebody said something. Somebody said something. Who said something about you to cause you these problems? 
twin flame cheating it's about somebody cheating and and silence you could have dumped somebody or somebody felt betrayed or cheated so this individual started to lie and involved third party so the the root cause was not you you understand the root cause was cheating and broken trust either somebody cheated on you or you cheated on them or somebody else got cheated on some twin flame involved here so lies and they involved third party and started to fabricating all of this sick character but that should have been properly investigated but instead, these crooks decided to make money on you because nobody wanted to lose their corrupt positions that they obtained initially. They had bigger plans. You understand? They had bigger plans. They could have not afford to be exposed for their corruption. You understand? So initial complaint was because of some sort of twin flame romantic bullshit that happens all the time. People get together. People broke up every day. It's not the reason to, to, to proceed and prosecute an individual uh, due to the fact that they're exercising their freedom of choice. But these two corrupt lunatic thieves, the air sign and the Scorpio, man, narcissists, they didn't want to bother. So if you don't want to bother and properly exercise your official duties, then what the fuck are you doing at your job? Leave. So now they're harassing you, right? Now they're after you because you're calling out the truth. That's that's it. That's exactly that's exactly what is happening. Exactly what is happening. All right, so let's finish this up and let's see what waits upon these crooks. The fact is that they're gonna lose job. This is important message for you to know. Six of Swords, Three of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles, Ten of Swords. There's some other female here also contribute here. And a masculine, sketchy, sick King of Swords masculine as well that connected to this Queen of Pentacles. So point is they're, they will leave you the F alone. So this Queen of Pentacles could have been, like I said, a liar who lied, who fabricated, who tried to entrap you. By complaining about you because she got cheated on or the fact that she wanted simply to remove you and along this sick masculine over here we have king of swords and a moon card an alcoholic a very sick uh sick person but it's shown me two two of cups so maybe they're together maybe it's a couple okay maybe it's a couple that did this so there's an ending. There's an ending to this uh, whole shenanigans with these individuals. What else you need to know? <clears throat> Devilish. Crushed. Teething. Alone. Exit plan. Trying to run away. Distant complicated it's a, some sort of relationship complicated they're thinking about running away but but it's complicated they can't run away they're trying to they can't run away they, it's, it, it's no possible way that they could run away they can't but they're thinking they're thinking of running away i kind of get this feeling that they're trying to hit the road checking out the routes maybe potentially where they're going to relocate they, they want they thinking they think that if they can get away if they can run away that they won't be held accountable. So they're thinking about some sort of journey, okay? Packing their shit. Packing their shit. So they need to be busted immediately before that happens. Um, before they actually have an opportunity to escape and run away. But they're thinking of of uh, running away somewhere. Distant, somewhere away. Somewhere away. For you, there is a new lover coming in and marriage. Some mature man. 
mature doesn't have to be age-wise mature. Uh, just another person mature that is responsible, individual that is responsible. And, uh, of course, coming in for marriage for you, okay? The situation with this karmic is, like I said, ends. It's ending. Nor these crooks, officials, will, will get away with what they did. Uh, in fact, some of them already started losing their jobs for participating in this miscarriage of justice. And in particular, that unethical couple here that, that are now trying to run away because they think if they get away, then, hey, who will find them? I mean, police don't cannot find anything, right? I mean, pff, what are we talking about? Cops? What do they find? Just kidding. Um, police are actually well, well organized on many levels and believe me you don't get run away so this is the message my wonderful collectives for you i hope you enjoyed it don't forget to like share and subscribe i'll see you next time bye